This weekend is already Easter and it's time to color some eggs. I want to welcome everyone to my channel. My name is Birgit and today I'm going to show you how I colored my Easter eggs when I was a child. So before I boil the eggs, I poke a little hole on the one end so that it cooks a little better. My eggs are boiling and I have my six cups ready here and each cup I put one of those dye tablets inside. So I'm just gonna put a half a cup of uh, water in here in each one and uh, then I'm going to add two tablespoons of vinegar in each one. There. It says to use warm water but I cooked up some water because by the time I uh, do my creative decoration on the egg and put it in there, the water will be warm. So now I just uh, took some of the eggs out of the hot water and I'll start decorating. They need to be hot for the decoration that I do. So now the fun part begins and you can be very creative. You can take your crayons. I have my, cray my uh, wax crayons here already. And I've wrote one of my children's names on here, which is John. And I can take another color and I can make some, just some round design here, add it on. And, uh, and on the other side, to make some pretty, Designs, I'm holding it with a, with a napkin because it is really hot. And I could make some dots or squares or whatever you feel like doing there. And turn it around a bit, go to the other side, make some more circles or whatever you like. Um, you can also take um, another color, make a different color dots. Uh, you can also make a little flower. And then when you're ready, you can put it into the color you choose in the cup. You also can lay the eggs uh, sideways like this on the tray. And I'm going to write my next uh, name on here which is Sally there and then I can make some little turn it around a bit and make some little flower and make some more flowers I turn it around a bit make some more flowers and it on the hot egg it melts really nicely there And now I'm going to put it into one of the colors and let it sit for a while. So I choose a color that is not on the egg here that I drew it with wax and I'll let it sit there for a while until it's the color I'd like. So I take out three or four eggs at a time from the hot water so that they stay warm for when I want to put my designs on the wax, with the wax crayon. And here is one already finished. So that looks really pretty, I think, and very personal. So here are my colored eggs all finished. I want to thank everyone for watching today's video and I will be using these uh, pretty decorated eggs in tomorrow's video. So please join me again and you all have a wonderful day and enjoy coloring your Easter eggs.